four teams in the Valley with a shot to play in the state tournament for high school soccer. We start in 4A Hidalgo taking on Bernie Valley Sports Central's Ruben Juarez at the game this afternoon. Here's Ruben with a recap from Corpus Christi. Hidalgo making the regional final and going up against a familiar foe, the Bernie Greyhounds. Bernie and Hidalgo played earlier this season with the Pirates coming out victorious, uh, three to nothing. The Pirates looking to make it another victory against uh, the Greyhounds. Let's go ahead and take a look at the highlights. First half action, uh, no score. Bernie with a corner kick. A junior defender, Brett Hetty, rises and hammers the header home. The Greyhounds uh, take the lead. Bernie up 1-0 at the break. Second half now, less than 20 minutes to go in the game. The Pirates give it to Reynaldo Cantu. The lefty gives it a go from outside the box. He rips a rocket to the top corner. Hidalgo ties the game. The Pirates go in bananas. Overtime now, Bernie with a free kick. The ball hits the far post and bounces right back to Ezekiel Price, who pounces on it. The header from close range makes it 2-1. Bernie. Moments later, Hidalgo's other Reynaldo, Reynaldo Trevino, hits a missile from outside the 18. He beats the keeper. We've got a tie game of two to two. The game would go to a penalty kick, a shootout. Hidalgo goalie Sergio Castañeda stepping up and shining bright in goal. Castañeda denies Bernie's first attempt. He made multiple saves in the shootout. Now it's Reynaldo Trevino up to the spot for the win. Trevino cool as the other side of the pillow. Hidalgo wins the PK shootout 4-2. to two. Let's hear from the regional champions. We have to talk in the locker room before the game. So no matter what happens, we're always going to call back and make it happen. We came back from 0-1, tied it up 2-2 and won in the PKs. And that's what it's all about. It's all about heart. And uh, we're looking for two more. We're going to PKs. Our goalkeeper rouses up in the middle and tells us, I'm taking you guys to state. I promise. I promise. I'm taking you guys to state. He, and he, he did exactly what he promised, and uh, he's the man of the match right now. We already know that if we come back, we're going to go to penalties. If we're going to penalties, we're going to win because we, we have a talent uh, shooters, and we know that we're going to win, and all, all the glory to God. That's, that's it. The trip to state will be Hidalgo's third overall and first since 2009 when they won the state title. Reporting in Corpus, Ruben Juarez, Valley Sports Central. Thank you, Ruben. Hidalgo punching their ticket this afternoon. So back here in the Valley, Sherryland in the boys' region for 5A final. The Rattlers taking on Leander Rouse. The Raiders with only two losses all season. Sherryland firing on all cylinders this postseason. No score in the first half, so second half action. The Raiders strike first. 65th minute, the crosser leads to a Brandon Fournier header just out of the goalkeeper's reach. But not so fast, says Sherry Lynn. Five minutes later, 70th minute, the crosser, Juan Trevino, with position in the box. Goal by Trevino. The header ties this ball game up at one. Both sides desperate to break the tie late. 83rd minute, Gail Cantu with the cross. It's batted to Ika Ureta, who settles it as he shoots and he scores. The biggest goal for the sophomore's career as Sherryland moves on to the state final for a 2-1 to one come from behind win. We move to San Antonio now. Rivera taking on Dripping Springs for a state playoff spot. First half action. Raiders trail 1-0 after a PK, but Adrian Longoria changes that with a goal of his own. That ties it up at 1, heading into the half. Second half, the Tigers on the attack. A little miscommunication in goal. Leads to an open net for Dripping Springs as they hold a one on to win 2-1. to one. Rivera's season is short just at the state tourney. We talked the boys' matchups. Now the only girls' team from the Valley still alive, Mack High. The Bulldogs with a chance to reach the state final four in 5A. McCallan taking on undefeated Smithson Valley. No score at the half. Rangers with a penalty kick. Allison Toyle, a fantastic save to keep Smithson off the board. But the Rangers with a free kick opportunity late in the second as the kick Gets past the goalkeeper as it is a heartbreaking one nothing lost in McCallan's season.